What's heavier than a ton of carbon? A ton of carbon tax, of course. Now imagine this. You're driving a monster truck, the kind that crushes cars for fun at shows. Pretty heavy, right? But then, you're told you'll be hauling an extra load, a blue whale, the largest animal ever known. That's the kind of weight Canadians are feeling with the recent hike in the carbon tax from $65 to $80 per ton by the federal government. Cue the critics. Conservatives, premiers, and the Canadian Taxpayers Federation alike have all voiced their opposition, citing increased costs for Canadians. It's like being told you've got to haul that blue whale uphill, both ways, in the snow, with no snow tires. Meanwhile, MPs are getting salary raises. It's like they've got a team of huskies pulling their whale, while the rest of us are left to strap on our snow boots. So if you thought carrying your groceries was heavy, try lugging around a ton of carbon tax. You know what's more Canadian than maple syrup and hockey? Protesting about taxes. Picture this. A group of folks rallying under the banner of the nationwide protest against carbon tax. Their goal? The immediate removal of the recently hiked carbon tax. It's like a pop-up party that no one saw coming. Except instead of cake and party hats, there are placards and passionate speeches. Now imagine this shindig causing such a ruckus that it's slowing down traffic near Cochrane. It's like a traffic jam but with a lot more signs and a lot less honking. Instead of the usual chorus of car horns, there's the symphony of chants demanding tax cuts. And the RCMP? They're there. Not to join the party but to ensure everyone's safety. Talk about a Canadian-style block party, eh? But, let's not forget the irony of it all. MPs are getting a salary raise while the rest of the country grapples with the increased costs. It's like showing up to a potluck with a store-bought pie and then eating all the homemade lasagna. So, if you're stuck in traffic near Cochrane, you might want to join the protest. At least you'll have something to do while you wait. But wait, there's more. Like a late-night infomercial, the carbon tax saga has another side. Let's take a moment to hear from the Canadian Taxpayers Federation. They're not too thrilled about this tax hike, arguing it's going to increase costs for Canadians. Picture this, you just got a pay raise but your lunch money now requires a second mortgage. Not the best deal, right? Speaking of pay raises, amidst all this carbon tax controversy, members of parliament have been quietly padding their wallets with salary increases. While the rest of us are left to grapple with the financial burden of the tax hike, they're laughing all the way to the bank. It's like being told to diet while someone else is having a feast right in front of you. So that's the carbon tax saga folks, a tale as heavy as a ton of carbon and just as taxing. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share, subscribe and give me your opinions. See you next time.